for a very long time, giveaways have been the easiest way to quickly launch and rank your Amazon FBA products. But recently, a YouTuber posted a video claiming that Amazon changed the algorithm and that giveaways were no longer effective. So if you're wondering if you should be doing giveaways or if you should throw that idea out the window, then keep watching because that's what we're gonna figure out today. What's up, Empire Builders? Gerald here. I just got back from LA, finally coming down from my cold. Um, and while I was there, this whole drama kind of started with this this big rumor that was going around about uh, giveaways no longer working. Now, you can probably guess by the guess that we have on this video which way I'm going to go with this. But before we get into letting Casey get on here to explain this, Casey is the, the Viral Launch CEO. Um, I'm going to go over why I think a lot of people reacted the wrong way to this. So I, was, I, I got to see this video before it got deleted from YouTube and I saw a lot of the comments um, saying, hey, I knew it, Amazon is dead. I guess I'm not gonna start this business anymore. Um, Amazon's too volatile or they, they, they're too unpredictable. They change, they change their algorithm, they can change their algorithm like that and all of a sudden your business plan is out the window, right? So once this, when the video came out, <clears throat> sorry, it's a little late, guys. <laughs> and as I said, I'm coming out from a cold, so excuse my voice. But um, when this video came out, it started spreading this fear, and people started getting scared away again from this opportunity, uh, which is Amazon, right? And it just clicked. I found it a little funny the way the people reacted because really, giveaways are just an aspect of the game, and they're not even a 100% necessary aspect. To, to Amazon and just seeing that one person claims that giveaways no longer work with a less than you know reliable test and all of a sudden everyone's running away. What I, my point before I get into this and let Casey kind of take the, take the mic here is that where there's a will, there is a way, right? So Amazon changing a giveaway algorithm, that might happen, right? It, it might actually be something that could happen but that shouldn't stop you from running at Amazon full force. If you're someone that was scared away by this rumor, um, then you were already looking for an excuse to not take action, to not start, right? So don't just look for the cop-out. Don't try to you know, justify a reason for not starting. Go for it. Like If this is something you wanna do, then go for it. And, and if Amazon changes an algorithm, look for a way to, to get around that. Like, like I said, giveaways have never been like, 100% uh, crucial part. You can launch products successfully without them. You can use PPC, you can use outside traffic. It might take longer, but there's there there are ways to do it without just relying 100% on giveaways. And some people might, might even say you shouldn't rely on, on giveaways in the first place, right? But that's a, that's a topic for a different story or a different video. Um, but yeah, I just want to get that point across that you shouldn't be afraid of Amazon's algorithm changing or you know Amazon changing different things because at the end of the day there's so many things you can control um, and if you are taking your business off of Amazon um, the way that we teach uh, on this channel through click funnels and through landing pages and really creating your own customer base then it's really not an issue in the first place so now that I got that out of the way I'm sure you're wondering do giveaways really work uh, what's this whole big uh, deal about um, well then, I'm going to introduce you to Casey Goss, a uh, friend of Nick. Nick is the one that got him onto this channel. Uh, so yeah, that's it. What's up guys? It's Casey Goss here from Viral Launch. Nick asked me to come onto the channel just to clear up a couple of things around a rumor that was started last week that giveaways or promotions or launches, however you refer to it, are not working. And just to get started, it's absolutely untrue. Uh, if you've been in the space for any period of time, you could probably recognize this as one of those rumors that come up you know, every two, three months. I, th I think just back in February of this year, 2018, we actually posted a case study because so many people were saying that launches weren't working and we just had hundreds and hundreds of successful launches like through that period of time. Um, and so we, we always think it's important to kind of clear up these rumors. Rumors are, are pervasive throughout selling on Amazon. And so I think it's our job because we have the data, because we have the experience to help you understand what is really working and what is really going on at any given point so uh, yeah we just 
like we're running hundreds of launches at any given time. I think this rumor just started last week and actually the guy took his video down uh, because I think there's such overwhelming data. There's so many people uh, leaving comments just about the case study not being great or just leaving comments about how, uh, you know, they had just run a launch and it was working really well. So I was actually pouring over some launch data from earlier this week uh, that some of the teams had sent to me and we are getting people ranking for words from like, you know, uh, 1.5 thousand searches per month to words that get over 200,000 searches per month, just giving the standard number of units away. Um, so watches are working really well. I uh, just want to clarify that or help Nick help you understand that launches are still a great tactic for driving ranking. Now, obviously I'm biased, uh, but we're definitely a company that's focused on helping you to grow your business, helping you to achieve results. And so uh, we're definitely not going to lie to you about that. Um, I'm, I'm in, at my apartment in downtown, so sorry people are walking by trying to get them out of the shop. But anyways, guys, hopefully uh, this helps you feel better about your launch strategy if you have one coming up. Still seven, ten, seven to 10 day giveaway are still working great um, again obviously biased but we just have the data we're running hundreds of launches at any given time if you have any questions feel free to shoot us an email and we'll gladly help you understand what are the best keywords is your listing set up well to succeed after a launch and how many units are gonna have to give away to achieve that page one maybe top 10 rankings whatever you're looking for so uh, yeah again Casey Goss from Vire Launch Thank you, Nick, for having me on, helping me to clear, clear the air on what's going on right now. Um, yeah, again, guys, I cannot encourage you enough to follow data, test things yourself, get in a great mastermind so that you guys can all gather data and make smart decisions together. Uh, I feel like probably the number one reason people fail on Amazon is because of lack of information, bad data, or you know, bad case studies. Uh, well. <laughs> case studies driven off of maybe a bad test or whatever. So guys, we're, we're always here trying to dispel the myths of what is happening on Amazon because uh, we try to be a very data-driven company. So hope you are doing well along your journey to Amazon FBA success. And thanks again, Nick.